Hi, this is John Herod, president of U.S. Freedom Biofuels in Mosinee, Wisconsin. I want to welcome you back. If you saw our first video where we talked a little bit about the history of U.S. Freedom Biofuels, why we started it, what got us excited about it, you know, you know that we're serious, we're passionate about building outstanding biodiesel production equipment. In fact, our tagline is, we build biodiesel production equipment for the commercial end user. Not the hobbyist, not the person that wants to build 40 or 50 gallons a week, but the person who needs to build 250, 300, 400, 450 gallons of fuel every eight hours. You know, we've got some folks who are using our BD65, for example, and they're literally running it around the clock. Some of our customers are running two and three of them at a time around the clock and making as much as 3,600 gallons of fuel every, 30, every uh, 24 hours with our BD65. So it's a great solution for a person in a commercial application who wants to build ASTM spec fuel, who wants to uh, put, produce a very consistent fuel with minimal amount of labor and minimal amount of cash outlay to get involved. That's very important because you know when you start getting into uh, biodiesel production equipment that produces 200, 300, 400 gallons, 450 gallons every eight hours, the prices in the marketplace skyrocket, but the technology is still the old school technology. What we did is we combined the best of everything we could find. By making several trips over to Europe, we discovered that they are about 10 to 12 years ahead of us in technology in building biodiesel production equipment. We've taken their knowledge, brought it back here to the States, and have designed a beautiful, beautiful system. It starts out with our preheat tank, which is also our dewatering tank. Now the dewatering preheat tank does just what it says. It helps remove the moisture from your feedstock. We don't want moisture, we don't want breading. And then from there, it's preheated, it moves into the processor. This shortens up the processing time, gets your temperature up to the optimal temperature, about 130 degrees, where we then inject it with methoxide. That whole process takes about 10 minutes of heating it up, injecting it, and then it circulates for 45 minutes to an hour. Everything is set up with timers. So you don't have to stand there. You don't have to wait for it to turn on, turn off. You set the timer, you walk away, go do something else that's important. In the meantime, you put another batch of feedstock oil into your dewatering tank, into your preheat tank, flip that on, and let it dewater. It's going to cook off that, that moisture. It's going to drop all the breading out of it. It's going to get that oil ready for the next batch. So while your second batch is preheating, your first batch is processing. Once the processing is done, that fuel now gets pumped into your settle tank. In the settle tank, the settle tank does two things for you. It helps to flash off your remaining methanol and it gives you a chance to pull off the glycerin. Well, you, once you've pulled that over into the, pre, into the settle tank, you're going to take the oil that's in the preheat tank and pump that into the processor. So if you can picture, you're literally working in a cycle. And every step is being multiplied. So while you're processing, you're also settling. And while you're processing, you're also preheating. So everything is running at the same time. It's very efficient. And that's how we get the high production out of our equipment. Now, how do we wash our fuel? Well, washing it can be done, obviously, with the old technology of water wash, but we use EcoTube here. It's a cellulose resin product that we pass the fuel through in our towers at a flow rate of a gallon per minute. So at a gallon per minute, it takes about as long to pump it over as it does for your processor to process the next batch of fuel. See, everything is set up to run at about the same pace. So there's no interruptions in this cycle of building fuel. So you flip the switch on and it transfers the fuel from your, your settle tank right into your storage. And from there, it's ready to go into any vehicle. Now, if you want to take and add the extra step of the, of the cold clear technology, cold clear, is a filtration system that can act as not only your polishing filter for your fuel, but it also helps you pass the cold soak test, the important cold soak test that the IRS just added in order for you to qualify for the dollar per gallon fuel credit.
So if you want the dollar per gallon fuel credit, add the cold uh, soak process or the cold clear system to your order. Uh, the cold clear system runs about $3,200, $3,300, and that'll pass the fuel at a rate of about five gallons per minute. So there's no big delay. And the best part about the cold clear system, yield loss is so small it can't be measured. And it lasts literally forever. I mean, you'll be able to pass 10 to 15,000 gallons of fuel through your cold clear system before you need a your first filter change. And your filter change, it's going to run you about $600 for all of the cartridges. There's six cartridges in there. But the bottom line, it's going to be very economical for you to be able to lower the cold filter plug point, the, the, uh, literally the uh, cloud point of your fuel can be lowered as much as 40, 45, 50 degrees, which means there's no need for blending. There's no need for additives. You're going to get all the benefits of your biodiesel fuel because you'll be able to run it at a B100 ratio instead of a, a B20 or a B11 or a B50. You can run B100 year round. And what does that do for you? Number one, 95% fewer emissions than number two diesel fuel. Number two, you're going to have lubricity like you've never had, which means less engine wear. Your injectors will last longer. Your injection pump will last longer. Your rings will last longer. You're not going to have the black smoke and the soot. So the side of your vehicle will stay cleaner. Your vehicle will run quieter. I'm telling you, you're going to love it when you start running B100 all year round. Now, we also build a B6, BD65 AF. The AF designation is animal fat. It's set up to process animal fat. So if you're a meat processor or you run a barbecue place and you've got a lot of meat juices and meat uh, tallow and and trimmings you can take that and turn it into fuel for every 10 pounds of tallow or or uh, animal fat that you have whether it be pork or chicken or or beef that's going to give you about a gallon of fuel so a hundred gallons it's going to take you about a uh, thousand pounds of animal fat to get 100 gallons of fuel. The BD65AF runs a little bit slower because of the uh, solidification point of animal fat. Uh, your, your animal fat will solidify at about 95 degrees Fahrenheit, so we've added a whole bunch of heating elements to your system to keep that, that oil flowing through the system, all right? But it does slow down the process just a little bit. You're only gonna produce about 250 gallons with the BD65 AF every eight hours. But that's still like five times faster than our nearest competitor and at a fraction of the cost. So if you're looking for a solution to your biodiesel needs, check out usfreedombiofuels.com. I think you'll find some answers there. Number one, we've got very economical dry wash towers. Our dry wash towers could be added to any biodiesel production equipment. And for less than $1,000, charged with the EcoPure and ready to start washing your fuel. We have Magnesol. If you're still using uh, the Magnesol type uh, dry wash, we have Magnesol available. We have potassium hydroxide available. We have titration kits available. We have pumps on our website. We have the accessories that you need to keep your existing biodiesel production in operation. But we also have the latest technology if you want to take it to the next level. And we can do it at economical prices, and we also provide financing. Check out our website. Go to usfreedombiofuels.com. Check it out. You can get a free quote right there on the website. Just click on the financing option, plug in the numbers, and we'll get you a quote right out. Okay? Listen, we appreciate you stopping by, and we do look forward to serving you.